of slow as hell right now. Uh, <laughs> but look at me. I walk so slowly. Can I read this? There's a notice about a seminar. Seminar at 921. Uh, yeah, I noticed that. I wrote it down for the th room thing. Is there anything else noticeable here, though? They don't usually make it this obvious, so just in case, I'm going to have another couple things written down just in case. How many times am I going to say just in case? So 0921 could be a possibility, but is there like... Ivan Adorale, this person's criminal behavior, a psychological approach will be referenced. So be sure to read it before coming. So the, reading that, the only other thing I can imagine is you'd have to go to the library and read the code. But other than that, that's it. So after resting, I guess we'll go to the library and get the code. However, I feel like it's a really bad idea to rest because I'll get killed. But, you know, I... If I can control this properly. Is this the infirmary? No, that's a janitor's room. Close enough. There we go. Okay, that's the infirmary. I'm asleep. I'm asleep. Leave me alone. I'm asleep. I'll take a little nap. Pushing myself wouldn't be a good idea. Why not? Ugh. The throat is really dry right now. I'm not sure why. Oh, that don't sound good. Mom? Are you crying again? Oh, sorry. I, I can't do a thing. I can't even console you. I don't like that. A dream. Yes, a dream. Yeah, Mom always cried in the living room after I had gone to bed at night. That was when I was a kid, though. Well, I'm feeling better now. All right, let's go. Oh, yeah, much better. Now let's go to the library, see what we can, if we can find anything out. If there's, like, another code or something. There's a faculty room that's not a library. Where is the library, actually? Is it? Dr. Lewis, no. Huge McGuire must have a huge ass. I'm sorry. <laughs> Reference, actually, no, this would be it. Reference room. Um, books on legal history. I don't know what I'm looking for here. Books on... Apparently, that was it. Okay. Criminal behavior, psychological approach. That notice in the lecture room mentioned this. I don't understand a word of it. Hmm. There's a slip of paper in here. What's the number 9981 for? Okay, I guess I'm writing that down. Sorry. I put this right next to my mic. I don't know why I did. Ugh. I'm gonna grab a couple of slips of uh, these. Just in case. Um... So 9981. The other one, I believe, was 0621. They both have to do with Franz Moore. So one of those has to be the code. 9981 or 0621. It's more likely 9981, just knowing how this game has been working so far. But um, if I could find a freaking pen, that'd be great. I should have this, I should have had this prepped beforehand. Then again, who uses pens nowadays? <laughs> nope, we all use our damn phones. Okay, so it's either 9981 or 0621. Six, 0621 representing a date. I think it was the birth date or something. I don't even remember what it was. Oh, no, it was the date of the lecture. So it's unlikely it's that one because, again, it's the date of a lecture, but also, you know what, I don't know. We'll, we'll, we'll go find out. Is he on this floor? That'd be make, that would make it very inconvenient. Dr. Lewis, no, because this isn't, yeah, this is McGuire. <laughs> Over here. Nope, because that's the faculty room. So he's on the top floor then. 
Cool. This one? Bronze more. Yeah. Okay. So first we're gonna try nine nine eight one because that feels like the more likely one. Nine nine eight one. Cool. There's a key to the computer room inside. Okay. Okay. Nice. Where's the computer room? <laughs> Cindy Peterson. Uh, is this it? Andrew Robinson. Oh, wait, no, these are just offices. And yeah, John Key. That's, I think that's the only one I haven't unlocked yet. I think I've unlocked and taken care of the rest of them. So we're getting close to done with this area. Cool. Computer room, is this it? Reference room. No, no, it's on this floor, though, I think. Yeah. Unlock the computer room. Why is there something in a trash can? Printed by Andrew Robinson, ID 144246. That has to be the code that we literally just read about. Okay, time to write things again. 144246. Why do I feel like I'm going to get walk away from this and he, the monster is just going to be right there? The crooked man is just going to be right there? Never mind. I was wrong. <laughs> what? Uh, excuse me? <clears throat> Friends, faculty, and staff, I thank you for coming today. We're glad to have a sunny graduation to start off the rest of our lives. Is this the same stuff that I've already read? Haven't I already read this? The future may be uncertain for some, but the persistence we learned here will make us resolute. A round of applause for my fellow graduates. I am not a robot, but I want to sound like GLaDOS from Portal, so here we go. <laughs> what? The laptop? But it wasn't on. However, a valedictorian. As valedictorian, there's something I can't help but lament. It's about David who... Oh no, don't, don't. He was highly skilled, kind to us all, and admired by pupils and teachers alike. We all expected he would be proudly standing with us this... He failed. Oh, don't do, ugh. But our hopes were dashed by none other than the man himself, hiding behind an innocent face. He's been fooling all his pupils. What? No. No. What the hell? Let me ask you all this. Should he be forgiven? Can he escape punishment for betraying his friends and mentors? This is his mind, isn't it? This is, this is David's mind, isn't it? Oh, shut up. I didn't think so. He should forever be punished for what he has done to grant his selfish dreams. Huh? Huh? David, stop thinking this. This is bull. See? See? It's David. It's his own mind. Stop it. Stop! David, it's just... <laughs> Let me take a drink before I go... <laughs> You're the lowest of low. Your dreams will never come true. What are you even good for? Shut up! Go off and die somewhere, coward! Uh, no, no, stop! Wow. No, I'm, I'm not a coward. You're not. I, I just... D, I heard a scream. That was you? Jeez, you made me freak. Oh, shut up, D. What's the big idea, huh? Did something happen? Forget about it. Sorry to startle you. It's nothing. D hey, dude. You okay? You're super pale. I don't know if 
all I want to tell you. You didn't believe me last time. Why would you believe me this time? I'm just kind of tired. I came a long way, and I haven't slept. <sighs> Leave me alone. I can't be bothered to talk. Oh, God. Oh, God. Oh, I know where this is going. Um, he's just trying to help for once. Have this. Aw. David, if you don't take that, I swear to God. Huh? I already had a little, but it's an energy drink. Drink up. What? Seriously? I, I don't need this. I told you, leave me be. David! I mean, I get it. I get what's going on in his head. I've been there, believe it or not. I've been there. Some people who are actually subscribed to me know this. Drink it! Jeez. You really look like you need food and drink. I'm being nice, so at least accept it, will ya? Yeah, I know! <laughs> Alright, thanks. But what's all this from... The guy... But what's all this from the guy who was calling me a shady punk? Mostly cause you look like crap, dude. Come on, it's not like I'm heartless. I mean, I am trying to be a lawyer. He's got a fair point. Because of that aspect, now that I think about it, I shouldn't really blame him for being skeptical about someone that he has never met or come across before. So, I mean, that is literally the same thing <laughs> in this circumstance. Come on, David. Besides, maybe it's fate. Tell you what, I won't call you shady anymore. Now cheer up. You could be my client once I'm a lawyer. Sure. <laughs> That's a quick turnaround. I'm grateful at any rate. Say, have you seen anyone else around? Particularly a man about my age? Hmm? Nope, nobody. He's who you're looking for? Yeah, though I don't really know how he looks. <laughs> That's something you want to tell someone you don't, you kind of just become, 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 became acquainted with. Tell me if you see him, okay? You got it. Doubt anybody would be here around, though. That made sense. <laughs> oh, but can I ask something, too? Professor Andrew, he always helped me out. His room's on the third floor, but it's got a number lock, so I can't get in. I think I got it. It was a six-digit number lock, right? I was thinking the professor might still have some lecture notes from here around or something. But yeah, tell me if you get it open, okay? All right, got it. <laughs> I'm going to do it right now. Why don't you just stick around, buddy? I'll wander around some more, then. I'll wander around some more, then. You look like hell, so don't push yourself. These are words I hear all the time. <laughs> IRL. Yeah, well, you be careful too. If you see any monsters, get away. Not this again. Yeah, yeah, sure. I've got a knife to defend myself anyhow. Smell ya. You know what, that's fair. That That is very fair. If you didn't have any kind of defense mechanism, then... <laughs> Maybe he's not as bad as I thought. You know what, I, yeah, I, I, got an energy drink. Cool. Where am I going? <laughs> Wait. Reference, oh, oh, no, 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 one floor up, one floor up, right. I was in the computer room. I completely forgot about that. Is this his office? Cindy, no, it's this one, right? Yeah, Andrew Robinson. One four four two four six. One. You have to make it all the way down there. One four four. Oh my God! Two, four, six. Hey! <laughs> now what? Lots of books. What does this say? Looks like some sort of diary. Finally done with the finals. I'm glad everyone got their appropriate grades. Of course, there's that loan deed. 
Oh no. I teach him so much, but he doesn't even get the basics. He's lagging behind everyone else, and yet he's so intent on being a lawyer. The nickname D stands for Dreamer. Okay. Apparently, it was given to him for having such an impossible dream. But if you ask me, it's for the grade he'll always get. Alright, that's just a dick thing to say. I hate how he fawns over me, too. I practically have to act nice to him. Have to, Wow. This teacher really is a douchebag. And he always comes for lessons after school. I wish I'd never let him in my class. I just hope he gives up on his dream soon and finds another path. At least this guy's persistent. This is about D? It's awful that he'd say this about a student. So maybe D really is that bad. Oh, come on, David. Stop that. If D saw this, it'd be a big shock for him. He said he respected his professor and always tried so hard. There. I tore that I tore the page out. Wouldn't want D coming in and finding this. Got a page from Andrew's diary. Why do I get the feeling D's gonna find this and then be pissed off? Alright, D, where are you? Oh. Yeah, I don't want to go back there. Nope. What? Uh, that monster is still wandering around. Is he looking for me since he couldn't kill me before? Why don't we go after him? Because we're smart people. I'm going to have to persuade Dee to leave. It's way too dangerous here. I'll go look for him. Uh, I don't know where him is. Maybe the one area we haven't been in yet? D? D? I... Not in here. D? D. D! Dreamer! Oh my god. Hey. Not in here. Okay, so he is going to be in the main hall. Which room, though? Or maybe it's the one that I haven't checked yet. The basement? I have a really bad feeling. The air feels kind of heavy. What even is this? Uh-oh. Let's be an idiot and go in. <laughs> After we save, because I don't want to fuck anything up. I always delete that third file just in case. Alright, let's go in. D? Hey, D, what's wrong? Get up. Eh, my head. I feel like crap. Now that you mention it, it's a little hard to breathe. What's going on here? It's gas. Huh? The floor is leaking gas. You gotta get out. Got it. D, get up and lean on my shoulder. <laughs> oh, oh. It's here. Ugh. Not gonna let us go. C crap. The gas is pouring in. I'll be poisoned if I'm not quick. How did this happen? I got two minutes to get out of here. Got an iron pipe. Oh my god. What do I do? Damn it. What do I do? It's sink or swim. Well, that wasn't the right choice. Iron pipe. Oh, shut it. Box, it won't open. 
a break here. Oh, shut it. Shells are empty. Oh, my God. Drawers, nothing in. Nothing in. Do nothing. Do nothing. Oh, for the love of Cardboard boxes. Oh, my God. What do I do? Nothing else. Are you kidding me? What the hell? Let's just burn the place. I don't know what else to do. I don't... Why? Why? How was I supposed to know about that? Uh, iron pipe. Could I widen the crack with the pipe? That seems almost impossible. No, 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 time for hesitation. I gotta get out or I'll die. Did it work? No good, huh? Maybe it needs some more? Do it again! <laughs> What do I do? What do I do? Hammer? Well, I'm gonna die. Never mind. Oh god. Oh god. Oh god. I'm dead. I'm dead. I'm dead. I'm dead. I'm dead. Oh god. I'm gonna die. I think I know what to do next time, though. Yep, I'm dead. Got me an achievement though. <laughs> um. Okay. At least I know what to do now. Got an iron pipe. That's all I can get in here, apparently. What the hell? Okay. So use. Uh. Hammer. <laughs> oh, will you stop it? Stop that! I am... Um, crowbar. Can I pry this open with a crowbar? I have to at least try. It must be. I mean, that's the only thing that would work. What in the hell? I can go up through the door in the ceiling. Are we done? Oh, come on! I'm just carrying D on my back here. I think we're good. I think we're good. Speed runner! Okay, we're good. <sighs> I managed to escape. Hey D, are you okay? I'll get you to the infirmary. Hang in there. Are you sure you're okay? You don't want to go to the hospital? What if you got poisoned? <laughs> I'm fine. Head hurts like hell, and I feel gross, but I'll get better. Thanks, man. I'd be screwed without you around. I owe you my life. There's a water storage in the basement, and I once heard about it leaking gas. Only just remembered that now. It was after I graduated, so I don't know for sure. But I think there was a dispute over the property. So the school moved, and this got abandoned. Okay, that's how that happened. Okay. I see. But you really do shouldn't have come if you knew it was dangerous. Just shut up. <laughs> I just sort of forgot, okay? Man, to think all this that happened when I just came here to relax. Should have just stayed at home studying. It's good to get a breather, sure. Just... Not in abandoned ruins, okay? <laughs> That's really something, though. You're still studying three whole years after you graduated. Well, I always wanted to be a lawyer. Ever since I was a kid. No matter what, I will be a lawyer. So I kept studying, and I still do. And there's no changing my mind. That is really persistent. I call that good, actually. I see. 
but you're awesome yourself. Climbing the elevator while carrying me, you're buffer than you look. Oh, well, I did go to fight school. Serious? That's awesome. Really can't judge a book by its cover, eh? <laughs> yeah. But anyway, won't you get out of here already? It's all kind of dangerous here, and I'm not looking after you anymore. I know, I know. Well, it was nostalgic and refreshing while it lasted. I'll just rest here a little and go. You do that. I'll be going. Oh, hey, hold on a sec. Wait, what? You dropped so uh oh Crap. That's the paper I got. I picked up, isn't it? Here you- Wait, what? Huh? This looks like Professor Andrews' writing. Why'd you have this? Hey, wait! Don't read that! Uh-oh. Huh? Dreamer? The grade. He'll always get- Uh-oh. Hey, what's this about? How- Why did the professor- Uh-oh. This is... How he really felt? But you- Supported me. You said I'd be a lawyer someday. That's what you told me. Hey, D, calm down. God! That wasn't supposed to scare me, was it? <laughs> D! Ugh, that guy. He's in no condition. And a monster's bound to find him. I have to go after him. Oh, great! <laughs> you know what? I'm gonna save that for later. I'm gonna leave this video here. Thank you all so much for watching. If you liked this video, push that like button and so far you can't see it anymore. I might go in and heal. Um, is there time to do that? Will it let me? No time to, of course. <laughs> if you really liked it, consider subscribing to the channel. Got any suggestions for any other um, horror games, RPGs, or anything like that that you'd like to see? Let me know in the comments below. Want to check out any other horror games that I've done prior to this one? I'll have a link to one down over there. This game, however, will be across from my head over here. In the meantime, I'm out, but I'll see you guys later. Bye!